So my name is Javier Ursua, I'm CEO and founder of Medix. The day people won't have to lose their physical abilities as a consequence of aging, it's uh, at our doorstep. This presentation is about uh, how are we getting to that day. Arthritis is the first global cause of permanent disability. More than 300 million people are diagnosed with this condition worldwide. $140 billion are spent each year in the U.S. alone in direct medical expenses because of this, this pathology. The pharmaceutical companies in this light have been investing billions a year in what they call DMADs or disease-modifying arthritis drugs. In parallel, in this slide, you see some of the renowned medical institutions which are heavily investing in regenerative medicine treatment development. But how to know who will acquire this condition? How to identify how bad it will be or when it will occur and which is the best treatment for each case? That's where we come in, developing the first arthritis prognosis platform to instantly predict who is getting the condition, on what level, and how fast with just a common MRI. Today we're able to successfully measure specific arthritis biomarker variation from a simple MRI and as a result we have signed a collaboration agreement with a renowned cell therapy research center. We're currently designing clinical studies and working on our predictive models. So, Behind all this work, we find our Chief of Data Science, PhD in Physics, Boris Panes, our Chief of Engineering, PhD candidate of Biomedical Engineering, Carlos Andrade, and who speaks. Our advisory uh, on International Management is Marcus, you already know them. And our Science and Research Advisor is Wolfgang Church. We're currently building a dedicated medical advisory board uh, with top tier clinicians for our next steps. So I want to ask you a question. What is that activity that you love the most? That activity you're really passionate about? Maybe it's running, maybe it's playing tennis, golf, going trekking or skiing, spending time with your kids, playing with them, your grandkids. Now, how much would you be willing to give up to prevent losing that activity as a consequence of aging?